Hey, what's going on guys? This is the AFL part number WME-02. So, the this particular panel itself, it does feel very durable right off the bat when you get it out of the box. The gauge steel of this enclosure is very thick. It feels very well built. So, if you plan on leaving this at the job site forever, it should probably last forever. Um, the box itself that has the four holes there where you can go ahead and mount the enclosure and you do have your cable management loops right there so when your excess cable comes in through the top through these rubber grommets here uh, you can go ahead and route it in there properly. The It does have a couple notches here on the side where you can go ahead and use some zip ties to go ahead and keep the cable in place so that way you don't get kind of a uh, you know a rat's nest going on in there. Now the other side itself but before I go on I do want to mention on the bottom here there are two notches here where you can go ahead and maybe your end user wants to after the fiber is installed he can go ahead and lock it up and that way you know nobody gets in there and starts messing around with some cables. The other end of it opens up like that and you also do have the rubber grommets one on top one on the bottom so the fiber jumpers can exit you know either or it does include uh, a handful of small cable ties and your ID label strip so and this is the two panel one right here one right there so if you need more information as far as maybe dimensions of the box that sort of thing the depth you might want to check out the spec sheet on the website uh, go ahead and click the downloads tab and it should be in there in a pdf so to order online visit discountlowvoltage.com